Interesting. So I can get a permanent hose. It was pretty excellent. That seems like a waste of balloons. That would be real. That's also cool. I'll save the rest of my blue. Oh, it creates like a element on the HUD. Never mind. That'll be useful, but not gonna ruin stream quality with that. deadly than anything else in the game so far. There we go. The king never finished another painting. Then one night he went to sleep and couldn't even finish his own dream. And he's been trapped inside it ever since. Along with that stupid hippopotamus. like me. 
dangerous. stood there trying to think of something to say. The statue shut and the hatch slammed shut. And now there was no more need for talking. The king was awake. from my dream. What a strange dream it was. My life's work was being destroyed and all I could do was watch. Calm. Sit here by the fire. It all began right there in the house I grew up in. I heard a heavy knocking at the door just like on the night I left. Oops, guess I should do something about that. My bad. It means I have to actually find one of these cords that works, though. Here we go. And back in business. I opened the door, but there was nothing there. Just a white space. Oh, it was Young King. Seems a little, uh, two-dimensional. Lots of walls. Visible architecture. Follow a wall and you'll when I got get outside, somewhere eventually. Disaster. Some miscreant had painted everything. My garden was ruined. Is that John Cleese? Who spoke and said, 
Help me! Some little hooligan is running around splattering everything in the garden. I think he's headed for the... <laughs> Something got in my mouth. Oh, dear. Oh, I, I didn't do that. That wasn't me. He's lying from you. Or lying to you. Can't trust a thing that statue says. I saw my unfinished labyrinth, abandoned and forgotten. But at least it looked pretty sweet. And then the credits appeared. Your dreams have credits? Oh yes, and subtitles. Smart dream. Subtitles are very helpful. Uh, I'm not really sure what direction they want me to go, but I'll take the one that's available. Geiger. Your name must be sacrificed then, in the name of I saw climbing. my beautiful city, strangled by those disgusting vines. I built it to stand a hundred lifetimes and instead to be buried in one, a monument for weeds. Strange and confusing. How do I get to not be hanging out on a cliff? Full of people, like the old days. It smelled like roasted goose. For a moment, I was happy. Then suddenly, I was alone again. The world had become cold and dark. I felt my own death rising up around me. What? What am I supposed to do here?
Okay, it's on a timer. Got it. Thanks, Julie Perry. You're a pretty good children's book narrator. I floated past chunks of the house I built, or started building. Scarcely ten years later, and the whole thing was in ruins. My works were meant to last forever, but most of them will be gone before I am. You're kidding me. They got Terry Jilly? I was at a funeral. My own, as it turned out. No one was there, except you. I saw my monument, my last hope of leaving something that would live on after me, and I began to walk towards it. It's a good title, Ooze Animation. And with each step I took, I got larger. I just kept growing and growing like a teenager. life's work laid out in front of me. Soon it would crumble into dust or be painted over by someone who would come after me the same way I painted over what was here before me. I sat there, looking out into the darkness. I thought back on all the things I'd built and left unfinished. I realized something. I wasn't sad that it was all gone. I had fun making all that stuff. I would have done it anyway. And then, somehow I knew that when I woke up, all my work really would be destroyed. Oh, and that's yeah, sorry about that. Up. That was me. I you got here, but I'm glad to see you. I have something for you. This brush isn't mine anymore. My work is over. It belongs to you now. I hope it makes you happy and that someday they will say, he is a better man than his father. That door will take you anywhere you want to go, but leave quickly, child. None of this will last for long. And that night, even though he was very tired, Monroe did something that would have made his mother very happy. He painted.
Thanks, game designers. That was pretty adorable. Thanks for watching.